All right, welcome to our LLDP lab or CDP and LLDP. I think we're covering here. I'm just using Packet Tracer, so I'll drag a 2960 to the middle, one to the top, and a uh, router to the bottom, just so we can see a couple of different devices. Obviously, switch to switch. Ideally, choose the uh, crossover cable there. Otherwise, you have problems. Straight cable, switch to router. Gigabit zero slash zero. Not that it matters which interface. You just um, remember to no shut whichever interface you've connected to on the uh, router there. And by default, the interfaces will stay down on the routers. All right, so interface uh, zero slash zero, no shut. That will take uh, about 30 seconds to come up. Uh, go from red to green on the switch interface there. We've gone to green. So we'll go to the middle switch and then start looking at a few different commands. Obviously from a user mode to privilege mode. Show CDP neighbors, and you can see automatically uh, we've got two neighbors showing. There's a key up there for a router switch and other devices. Uh, device ID, local interface, whole time, uh, platform, and remote port ID. So you can see what the entries we have here for the remote switch, which is a 2960. Here, and then the uh, remote. The remote router there you can see the local interface remote interface and the capability is alpha router you can drill into more detail if you issue the show cdp neighbors detail command you can see um, platform again more information on the interfaces your ios versions full details of the model if you've got management IP addresses, I think they come up as well, but I don't have any configured here at the moment. So more detailed output, duplex type also on the interface. All of this is without any IP information having been added because it's a layer two protocol. So don't need to worry about it. Show CDP interface is another command. We've only got a few limited commands because it's packet tracer. And we can see how often it's sending the CDP packets and hold time. Now we'll go on to the router at the bottom. And no CDP enable is the command on the interface level. So this is if we just want to disable it on an interface. The entry will stay until um, we clear the CDP table. Now, um, it's got, it, it takes a while for the table to uh, repopulate itself. And again, it could be a problem with Packet Tracer just having a little bit of a glitch in there. And you can see the table still isn't uh, populating. Looking at the interface, CDP is running, so that's all okay. And then I hit the up arrow and there's an entry in there. So I'm not sure whether me looking at the interface triggered it or I just had to wait for the CDP packet to be sent because it's only every 60 seconds. No CDP run, disable CDP on the entire device. And then you can see that CDP is not enabled when you do any show um, CDP commands. Now show LLDP and you can see it's not enabled. Now the documentation says it is enabled by default on the 2960. So it could be an iOS or it could be a packet tracer thing. Show LLD, LLDP neighbors and there's nothing there. 
So what we need to do is go to our other devices and actually enable LLDP. So conf t LLDP run, that enables it on the uh, whole device. Obviously no LLDP run will disable it on the entire device. Okay, so we can see our switch here. We're going to need to do the same thing on the router at the bottom and uh, enable it. LLDP uh, transmit and receive commands if you want to enable it per interface. Now, something strange happens when you do this. The commands say it does enable it on an interface. However, um, it still needs to be enabled on the entire device. So that's a little bit strange that um, enable it on the interface doesn't just enable it on the interface because you may only want it to run on a particular interface. So LLDP run enables it on the entire device, which kind of negates the need to enable it on the interface. Could be a packet tracer thing. I don't have the uh, live devices to hand to test it. So we can see all of our output here. Everything's working fine. Show LLDP, neighbors, and um, yep, that's all we need to know. So thanks for watching.